We don't know how to make them yet, but clearly this is a thing in the universe. All right. So that sent people to the drawing board. Well, the center of the galaxy is quite a busy place. There are gas clouds that'll lose energy that can dip down into the center, get eaten by these black holes. These black holes can also attract stars and flay them as they come too close. There are mechanisms for these black holes in the centers of galaxies to grow by dining upon material that wanders too close. So we started modeling that and we're now feel comfortable with supermassive black holes in the centers of galaxies. We even learned that the more massive the galaxy is, the more massive the black hole is. That, that kind of makes intuitive sense. You still want to be able to explain it. The itty bitty galaxies, they have little itty bitty black holes. Itty bitty supermassive black holes. Okay, that gives us two categories of black 